Hi there. You're in the lab with your mate JJ. Today's screwdriver day. It's another unboxing. I'm actually going to be unboxing this Bosch IXO electric screwdriver. That's the main game today. But while I'm doing it, I thought I'd mention this, which I kind of think is pretty cool. I saw it when I was buying this and I picked it up. It's from Amazon Basics. So Amazon's got their own brand. Um, and they, they obviously make basic tools, I guess. And this is a basic tool. This is a screwdriver, but it's not just any old screwdriver. It's a ratchet screwdriver. And it's got three settings. It's got um, uh, removal and insertion. And then you can also just clip it in the middle and it doesn't ratchet at all. It just stays fixed. And in the tip, uh, you just squeeze these and bang, out pops. A selection of tips so uh, everything's in there it's got Torx bits and Phillips heads and flat heads so it looks pretty uh, comprehensive to me it's got a hexagonal bit as well I'm not sure what the Torx bits are it doesn't seem to say their size on the part that I can see it will though just pop this guy out this is uh, CRV 5 T15 so that's Torx 15 only goes down to 15. I do need the um, Torx 10, but I've got plenty of those anyway. So, uh, yeah, pretty happy with my Amazon Basics Ratchet Screwdriver. I paid $21.90. Delivered. Aussie bucks. Uh, US dollar equivalent. About $14. So for 14 bucks, you can get yourself an Amazon Basics Ratchet Screwdriver. Everyone should have one. I haven't actually used it yet. Just arrived this morning. But I'm going to keep it here, and I'm sure I will use it. Now, uh, this is the Bosch IXO electric screwdriver, and I got it with the angle adapter. So this thing will take something that normally points that way, and it'll point it that way. Um, so you could probably use it under your bench if you needed to screw something in that way. I guess, I don't know. Anyway, they said it was an accessory that was a, a, an option for me and I thought I might as well get it because I don't have anything like that. And it's the sort of thing that you don't need until you do. So that's it, basically. I paid um, Aussie dollars, $79 for the uh, electric screwdriver, which is US $50. US 50 bucks for this guy, delivered. And, uh, and for the angle screw adapter, actually, that was really quite expensive. I paid 26 Aussie bucks for that, which is US dollars, $17. So this thing cost me US 17 bucks, which is actually kind of a lot. And I don't know if I have a little bit of buyer's remorse over that one. I'm not sure. But if I ever need it and I've got it, it'll pay for itself. It's only 17 US dollars. So um, let's jump over to the bench and let's see what we got. We are in the lab. So this is the Bosch electric screwdriver, IXO brand or model. Uh, on the back, uh, it doesn't say much, does it? Just gives you a pic picture. It's got the the uh, driver itself, the box that it's in, uh, a couple of uh, a screw bits, and a micro USB charging cable. Cool. because what I need is another micro USB charging cable in my life that was sarcasm of course I'm not usually a fan of sarcasm but uh, it does take me from time to time so let's pop this guy open I'm probably not going to keep him in his case well it does look like a pretty good case I think this is the kind of thing I'm likely just to keep on the bench. So, we got our screw bits. We've got, uh, oh, that's a T10. A T10. It's a T10. That's the bit that I didn't have in my Amazon Basics. So we got a T10, that's huge, that's maybe T25. This T20. Okay, we've got T10, T20, and Torx bits. That'll get you into an Xbox, a T10 and a T20, but it won't get you into the 
uh, drive base, which is a T15. And then we've got various uh, Phillips bits. It looks like they've doubled up on some of the Phillips bits, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, this one, PH1, and this one is PZ1. Maybe it's triangular. I'm not sure. Never heard of PZ1 before. Anyway, there's a bunch of bits to go with the electric screwdriver. This is the charging cable, as promised. It's uh, type A USB to micro USB. Held together with a tip zip tie. I don't keep my zip ties anymore because I'm full. I've had so many of them, my, my zip ties box is full. So I don't need to keep any more. I, I find I never use them. I, I, uh, I keep them and I just never have a use for old zip ties. Usually I, sorry I said zip ties, but I meant, you know, those little um, wire things. I used to, I don't know what they're called. But yeah, I use the nylon zip ties when I need to connect things together. Alright, so we'll make a label for that. Um, and this is him. Comes with a little bit of charge on the battery. There we go. Well, that's the uh, direction switch on the top of it there. And uh, it's fairly well labelled. It's, uh, it's got a little sticker on the top. I don't know what that's all about. Called the screwdriver IXO6. IXO6. Ah, oh, look, it's got a little. Uh, uh, you can dock this guy. That's interesting. Should learn about the dock for the Bosch IXO. Might get myself one. All right, and then in the bottom is a bunch of paperwork, and that is everything for the case. It's a good case. I might use it for an electronics project or something. Yeah, definitely a keeper, but I don't think I'm going to keep my stuff in it. Uh, let's have a look at the paperwork, huh? This looks pretty boring. It's all in German. Oh, there we go. Manufacturer's guarantee. Yeah, I'm not really sure what to make of this. Uh, all Bosch power tools, pneumatic tools, measuring tools and garden tools are carefully checked, tested and subject to the stringent controls of Bosch quality assurance. Okay, so they're just telling me how great they are. Wonderful. Now, register and get three years guarantee. Not going to be doing that. Three years manufacturer's guarantee. Simply register the tool online within four weeks after purchase to ensure three years manufacturer's guarantee. Service and support. Our fully trained agents will be happy to assist and answer your requires quickly and competently. And in my workshop, register your Bosch tools and benefit from an easy repair service handling. Yeah, okay. Well, it's a very... Uh, uh, international kind of thing. It's got everyone's language on it, which is great. Uh, it's very European of them. Bosch. It's probably German, isn't it? I'm not real sure about Bosch. Ah, Robert Bosch Australia, Proprietary Limited, Bosch Power Tools. Voluntary repair or replacement warranty. So this is some sort of warranty with the terms okay and this is what we've all been waiting for the manual so one two three oh that's interesting I wonder if it'll take my long bit yeah oh that's good 
so I can use the, the bits that I've already got. I don't have to just use these bits. And I think I've got some... Uh, So these are three sizes of Torx bit with long handles, good for uh, Xbox repairs, perfect. So I'm just going to keep them in this, can you see that? What do you reckon? No, no. Perhaps not the best place for them, maybe here. Yeah. Alright, well I'm just going to keep them in my drawer here, um, which are the bits that I can use for the electric driver. So here's the manual, this is IXO, I've got the IXO version 6, and it points out the various parts. And it tells you how to plug in the power adapter, it tells you how to plug in the bit. Oh, it looks like you can... Oh, I see. You can take off this bit. Presumably it screws... Oh, no, it might just pull. Let's uh, see what the manual actually says about that. Oh, it says just pull. Just uh, doesn't pop on really. Oh, there we go. It's okay. Yeah. Right. All right. Okay. Well, we might as well pop out the accessory, which is the uh, <coughs> the angle. telling you how to use it, just like it said over here, you pop that bit off, you pop that bit on, you pop that bit off, you pop that bit on, looks like it's pretty straightforward to me. Oh, I see, how clever, very clever, let's pop him on, pop, rip on, and then you can just, uh, <laughs> Work at an angle. That's brilliant. So you want to go under the table? No problem. I like. This is great. <laughs> what a novel bit of equipment. Yeah, okay, cool. And when you're done, you just pop them off. Oh, twist and ah, twist and, and pop them off. Well, that's good to know, isn't it? So that's a pretty neat bit of stuff. I'm going to keep him in the top drawer. And uh, drill bits. I'm just going to keep those on the bench. Now, I've got two other drill bits which were in my thing. Uh, I'm going to keep them where... Uh, I've got a... S2, S2, and this is S2, no, oh, they're the same, they don't look the same, alright, 
So I'll just keep flicking through this manual. So you can pop the bit off, you can put the angle bit on, uh, safety instructions, uh, personal safety, battery, tool use and care, recharge only with specified charger, use tools only with specially designed batteries, when it's not in use, keep it away from children, okay, service, warranties, secure, always, safety instructions, do not expose, product description, and product features. Intended use. The power tool is intended for screwing in and loosening screws. Product features. The numbering of the product features refers to the diagram of the power tool on the graphics page. Screwdriver bit, tool holder, rubber cap, battery charge indicator, rotational direction switch, hole for attaching strap, charge contacts, on off switch, work light handle, micro USB, charging cable power supply, offset angle adapter, angle screw adapter, unlocking ring. Technical data. It's got a whole lot of specs. I think it runs on a, a three point something volt battery. I think I saw that somewhere. Rated voltage 3.6. Okay. And assembly. Oh, there we go. It tells you about the, um, the lights, operation, servicing, transport, and then we get up to the Korean part of the manual. Okay. Well, I think that concludes our unboxing. This is my Bosch uh, IXO6. Um, I'm pretty happy with it. Looks pretty good to me. I'm going to investigate getting the, the dock for the charger. See if I can do that. Not sure where I'll keep this guy, but it'll probably be pretty close to the bench. Maybe over here on the... Uh, on the on that bench. <laughs> um, anyway, that's it. That concludes our unboxing of Bosch IXO six.